all night long. Yeah. Ola Ola. Love it. And say it different every time. <laughs> and I love that sunset behind you. Yeah, she's an angel and this is a very angelic looking shot there. It From Angelica. For me, just for me. <laughs> I picked it out. Yeah, Steve actually picked it out. It is, uh, what, 58 degrees right now in downtown San Diego. It's getting colder as we go into the overnight hours, and those temperatures will be plummeting all throughout the county. Let me tell you, though, if you're in the valleys and over the foothills, it's going to get really chilly tonight. A frost advisory in effect until 8 a.m. tomorrow morning from Valley Center all the way towards Alpine. We're going to see those uh, numbers falling tonight right along the 15. As we go to 8 o'clock, 47 degrees in the valleys by 9 o'clock. 45. That's how quickly temperatures will be dropping and here's why we had a storm system move through it brought cold air. Now a second one is starting to make its way in and it continues to usher in cold temperatures. So we're going to trend below normal through the beginning of the week. Here's the culprit for the chance of rain this weekend. It's still in the open water, but it's getting its act together right now, not in the main flow. So we're just kind of meandering. That's why the time has been changing a little bit and also the intensity right now. It looks like some of the heaviest rain is actually going to be down in Baja, so that's good news for us. Warming temperatures by the middle of next week, so it does get better for the start of March. But for tonight, bundle up extra extra sweaters, extra blankets. You're going to need it all. 28 degrees in Ramona, 40 Kearney Mesa, 38 El Cajon and 39 in Chula Vista. Tomorrow will stay in the low 60s, although a few degrees better than today. And tomorrow night it will not be as cold because clouds will be increasing ahead of the next storm. In our 10 news pinpoint seven day forecast chance of showers throughout the day on Sunday, 59 degrees on Monday. We'll see a few spotty showers once again, and then that system should be out of here by Tuesday. But like I said, since it's not in the main flow, it's going to stay a little bit behind and it's going to take its time before it gets out of here. By the time it moves out, we really make a nice improvement. Wednesday 70s by the end of the My week gosh. up to 75 degrees in the mountains. It will be breezy gust of up to 30 miles an hour on Saturday and the winds will be picking up again on Monday. This time next week is just gorgeous. Mm -hmm. Unbelievable. We'll forget all about the rain. By next week. All right. <laughs>